again, my name is Gabe Zolna. This is the 7th of February, 2019. One of my friends from Oklahoma watched one of my videos that I posted a while ago, and I talked about how CIA funded Google, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and a whole lot more. They might have even have funded 23andMe. You know, the site where you pay $100 and they analyze your DNA. Who do you think they give that information to? Huh? Matter of fact, a couple of killers have been caught thanks to those social media sites through their DNA, which is supposed to be private. Now, that friend from Oklahoma, again, he watched one of my videos and he sent me two of them. One of the video is titled Facebook and the CIA. The other is stuff they don't want you to know. Facebook. You want to listen and watch both of them. You're going to see who put a whole lot of money into Facebook. The CEO of PayPal, another dysfunctional organization, they actually shut my account down for no reason other than my political views which differ than theirs. You notice how these are all left-wing organizations? Don't you find that somewhat really interesting? I sure as hell do. Folks, I've posted countless videos on exactly this topic. Be interesting to know what operational names the CIA gave to these enterprises before they were named Facebook, Google, Twitter, or YouTube. They were all designed to do what? Well, harvest your data from all over the world. Facebook sells the information that people willingly provide to them. I got off of Facebook probably a couple of years ago. I got off of Twitter probably, I don't know, eight, nine months ago. The accounts are still open, but I don't use them. No reason to use them. They have everything that they need from pretty much everyone all over the world. The best thing that you could do if you care about whatever country you live in, stop feeding them data because they use it against us. There's no reason to go on Facebook other than personal ego to think that you're out there. But who do you really want to be out there with? Your friends. Don't you have their email addresses? Don't you have their phone numbers? What more do you need? Get off of those social media sites. They're all designed to hurt us. The CIA is a criminal, dysfunctional organization. They sit there and they plan for ways to screw us, to control us. Every one of these operations is what they're named are not intended to benefit any one of us. It's designed to benefit them. Go look at the McCallum memo. You'll learn about Pearl Harbor, Operation Mongoose, Operation Paperclip, Operation Dirty Trick. It goes on and on and on. That's what they do at the Pentagon. You think not? Think whatever you like. Our government is a criminal, dysfunctional organization. All you got to do 
is look at people that are in it, like Nancy Pelosi. She'll be 79 years old next month, and she's third in line from the Oval Office, and she doesn't even know who the president is. <laughs> Problem is, she's not alone. There's many people that are in our government that shouldn't be there. Their time has long left them. Watch these two videos and please stop using those social media accounts. They're all designed not for your benefit, but for the CIA's. Please repost this on all your social media accounts. Pass it along to your like-minded friends. Wake up, America. Wake up, world. Thanks for listening.